What's up everybody, this your boy Hollywood T with another Celebrity Flash and today we have Nell Carter. Three, two, one. Her trademark size complemented by a distinctively adorable voice that could outsnarl Eartha Kitt and Fran Drescher put together. Short, 4'11", round and robust, Nell Carter was an indomitable, in-your-face firecracker, and it made her star. Nell Carter was born Nell Ruth Hardy in 1948 in Birmingham, Alabama. She was one of nine children born to Horace and Edna Hardy. Nell grew up listening to the sounds of Dinah Washington and Elvis Presley and developed an early interest in singing that led to performances in various youth groups. This was a positive distraction for Nell due to the major trauma suffered from her early years. This included the tragic death of her father, who was electrocuted when he accidentally stepped on a live power line. This also includes the rape at gunpoint when Nell was just a young teenager. By the age of 19, Nell had relocated to New York City where she found work singing in a variety of venues. While studying at Bill Russell School of Drama from 1970 to 1973, Nell made her Broadway debut in Soon, a two-act musical show that lasted two days. Nell Carter made a star-studding leap when she was cast alongside for the 1978 Ensemble Review for Ain't Misbehaving. Nell received a multitude of awards, and the show was taped for TV in 1982. Tough and temperamental with a larger-than-life presence, Carter was inarguably drawn toward the small screen and was initially featured in the daytime soap, Ryan's Hope, in 1975. Now, Carter was also featured in The Misadventures of Sheriff Lobo in 1979. Audiences took to her immediately, and eventually she was landed her own vehicle as a loving but no-nonsense housekeeper of a white family in the NBC sitcom, Give Me a, Give me a Break. break. Give Me a Break ran for six seasons, earning Nell two additional Emmy nominations for Best Actress in the Comedy. Following this, Nell co-starred in You Take the Kids in 1990, which fizzled, and the already established Hanging with Mr. Cooper in 1992 as Mark Curry's boss. After a history of ups and downs, the 50-year-old Nell Carter collapsed January 23, 2003. At the time of her death, she was in rehearsals for another musical stage lead, this time in the Long Beach, California revival of the hit musical Raisin. The musical opened a few days later as scheduled with Nell's understudy taking over the role. Thanks so much for listening to the show. How are you doing to another celebrity flash?